Okay, so just to recap, I'm going to go through the list of our questions now. There's my car. Here's the drive up. You can't see the road from the drive up. You can see a neighbor. One of your questions is, can you see neighbors? <clears throat> Barely. Can you hear them? You could probably hear their chainsaw if they were running one. No, they don't. <laughs> matter of fact, there she is right there. She's about 75 years old. Is she out there? Yeah, she's in her backyard. <laughs> okay, so he can see the neighbors. I can't see. I can't see. You have to walk down. Back over here. Oh, okay, there she is. All right, so you do have neighbors, but I would say this is pretty private. I, I can't even see her. Private, there she is. Very private. Hi, neighbor. Very quiet. And I have the camera zoomed in, so let me just back it up so you can get it. I'm standing on the driveway. That's how far away we are. And I'm going to be quiet. That's I-5. You can hear it, like, so far in the distance that I don't, I wouldn't, I would say no. Noise, if anything. I would say no, you can't hear it. It's no different. Of, get a lot of uh, um, wildlife moves through deer, elk. We have had a bear here once. Uh, we get turkeys here. Wow, wild, wild turkeys. Mm -hmm. And when he says bear, we get black bear. They're scared yeah, of us. Yeah, we had yeah. one, one time, and that was probably about eight years ago. We haven't had one on the hill since. So this outbuilding, mm -hmm. is it full of stuff? It is. It's just dry storage, though. Dry storage. Okay. A measurement, would you say? It's about 12 feet by 30. Is it on a concrete pad? Yes, it is. Okay. Cool. Solid slab pad. Okay. Ivy. A little blah, blah. I'd remove the ivy. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Back to my question. We were just talking about pond potential, and yes, you can do a pond. When it comes to the water master, you refer to it as a decorative pond, and you keep it lined, um, which you'd want to do anyway. And there's a couple of different areas you could do that. That little culvert could be one, or you could just do a decorative recycling pond somewhere up here close to the house because, well, we'd have to check your water flow, but that's what I would do. You could hear it. And if you hear it, it would drown out whatever white noise you thought you heard in the distance, which I don't think is anything much at all. And the reason I'm going over here, guys, is the septic is somewhere over here, <clears throat> right? Where right where I'm standing. So in reference to the house and the neighbor, which you can't see. And the well is back there. So I'm going to zoom in from where I'm standing <clears throat> to show you how far away it is from the well. Okay, back. Now we're going in the house. Okay, it's live. Live at the improv here. <laughs> okay, no holding the mess against me. <laughs> okay, here we go. George. George, do you come with the deal, George? No, uh, George gets to stay with me. Okay, he's George's pole. Uh, very, well, here we go. All right, so it's vaulted. It's a nice wide mobile home, manufactured yep. home. Double wide. Uh, there is a wood old fire. wood stove. Probably, possibly not certified. You could put a certified one in. I checked the, you it know. Is, it is certified. It is certified? Yes. He says, okay, he says it's certified. You know, it, I would just have it inspected and cleaned oh, yeah, just to be sure. Course, Very nice windows. These are the, the vinyl windows. Well, they're also, does this turn and then yeah. pop out? Yeah. I can't remember the fancy term for that. Okay, and you got laminate floor here. Yep. Um, definitely a good layout for uh, remodeling potential, I think. Uh, love this. <laughs> love that. That will probably, the wife will probably take that piece of as, with her, I'm sure. As she should. I had one, and then when my house was redone, 
Uh, my contractor actually painted over it. I know, and you know, it was cool. It even had the dogs. Back there's the laundry room. Yeah. You want me to look? Okay. So, here's the back. Hang on. Laundry room back here. Okay. Okay. All right, and that door goes right out the back. Yeah. Where was that rot that I saw? Is that are we over no, by it? That's okay, back over there. There's definitely some, um, you know, potential water damage back there. I think I can kind of smell it. That's that's just bad laundry. Okay. Okay. Ceiling fan. Skylight. Um, anything else you wanna? You want me to just go ahead and go on in, or? Yeah, the bathroom here. Okay, that's where the damage was, right? Um, yeah. Okay. Yep. Well, do we dare take a peek? Yeah, you can take a look in there. Okay. Nothing so you can scary. tell that there was a plumbing leak. It does need a uh, new uh, liner in there. Okay. Okay, dokie. Don't try to fool anybody. Bedroom. Light here, so it's going to be kind of dark. Too dark to tell, but we've got a bedroom. We have two bedrooms, so it's a split bedroom three, plan. Three bedrooms all together. Yep. So two, that one. two bedrooms this on one side. Larger. That's a good size, actually. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then master. So, master. and is this a two bath too? Yes, but okay. the other bath is half functional, half not shut down. Just whoa, to, whoa, it's dark. It is dark. Here, let me. <laughs> Put the light on in here for you. Thank you. <laughs> hmm. It's about as lit as it gets. All right. This is very spooky. <laughs> it's just because we sleep at night, so we have the windows blocked off. Sorry about that. No, it's okay. It's all right. So I'm going towards a master bathroom. Mm -hmm. Which... Hmm, I don't know, 15 feet maybe by five, something like that. Does that room look ugly? Whoa. And that's because it hasn't been used? Gnarly, okay. And the only reason why is the, uh, the wall, the drain on this side, where it had a plug at one time for the bath, mm -hmm. started leaking, got onto the floor, and we didn't want it to rot the floor out, so... We stopped using this bath, switched over to the other bath. Okay, do you know what kind of piping and plumbing is in this unit? Standard that came with it. Is it a plastic polybutylene piping, or is it a uh, is, there, is it any kind of galvanized, or is it no, copper? it is not galvanized. Okay. <clears throat> At this point, we are going to press stop. I don't see any evidence of the roof leaking, but I bet you need to put a new roof on. Nice, strong foundation. Floors feel okay, other than the places that we knew were obvious. I'm going to step outside. Do you have a heat pump or in addition, or is this the only form? There is form a heat pump, but okay. it hasn't, we haven't run it in literally <coughs> 18 years. And the thing with it was it just seemed to suck electricity. So we you might need servicing. the stove and haven't touched it since. Okay. Well, see there, my camera's trying to get a glimpse of... The mountain views that you would be able to see live if you were here. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and well, I actually what I'm gonna do. I think I'm. I think I covered all my questions. I'm gonna go ahead and press stop. Thank you for allowing me the opportunity to do this video for you, and I look forward to talking to you soon. Thank you for your uh, consideration. <laughs> Bye. See there's.